hello everyone it's 164 days can you just imagine the days are actually running so fast i mean you will get the countdown here by the grace of god i will do this countdown till we get to that day 164 days to the 2023 election Woo! unbelievable right it looks so far away but it's really not so far away uh because we have so much to do we have so many people to talk to there are people out there who up till now they are not yet into the election they don't want to take part in the electoral process we need to talk to them because we need everybody on board when people stay away from the electoral process they do not take part in it then what normally happens is that the people who are not deserving of being in office actually get into office they need people to not turn up so we need to talk to a lot of people please get your pvc if you haven't gotten your pvc as much as possible go go and get your pvc take a day out and just go and collect your pvc and keep it somewhere safe i see a lot of people who are walking about with their pvcs please don't do that what normally happens people it gets what if your purse is stolen what if your wallet falls down what if one thing or the other this is such a precious 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 card that you need to keep it so safe out uh, somewhere safe and uh please 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 talk to people also tell them to go and get their pvcs and uh, continue to campaign for your candidates for remember we need credible people into the national assembly we need them in the national assembly we need them at the state houses of assembly because there is so much that the executive arm can do the legislative arm of government is actually the it's actually the bedrock of democracy they have oversight function they make laws and they also hold executive accountable what well, we've had all this why it's rubber stamp assembly and that's why you don't many people don't realize their impact but the legislative arm is actually more powerful than the executive um, and if we wanted a lot of things that people there are many people who want different things some people want restructuring some people want a new constitution some people want certain laws changes and all of that is the legislative arm of government that is going to give that to us so please 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 as we go into the election as we're counting down to the election go and get your pvc get yourself ready begin to talk to people about your candidate remember we are voting candidates and not parties look for a candidate whatever party it is just look for who is the first person vying for whatever position you can have a different person as your as a presidential candidate you can have a different party for your presidential candidate you can have a different party for your gubernatorial candidate you can have a different party for your house of rep member your senator your state houses of assembly member what we're going to do we're going to choose people based on their competence character capacity these things are very important it's time for nigeria to win don't you think so so this is it one six four days to the 2023 election and god willing nigerians let's do the needful and give nigeria a chance thank you and bye